You're right. You know, Kojak, I will, I will, right I will bow to you for once. Jeff, go ahead. No, wait. I want to hear what you was going to say. Yeah, go ahead. Tell the story. Tell your Twilight so story. Yeah. Yeah. Talking about Graham Hancock. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, I'm just showing him something. You guys can hear But please, God, remember yeah, what you was getting ready to say. I mean, say. Frank, uh, you got a Twilight Kojak. story. I, yeah. I was Tell me your Twilight story, please. All right. It's a great story. So, I had no idea what Twilight was. No, no idea at all. I don't read books. I don't read. I can't read. I'm dyslexic. I feel like I know what I'm literally going. dyslexic. That's not a joke or a bit. <laughs> that was funny. I, I don't care. Make fun of hey, me. What's you your hoodie say? So, wasn't it that you guys wanted to see a movie and you just looked at the. the well, the, here's what happened I listened to 89X. Yeah. And they're like, and they had an interview with uh, <laughs> whoever played the doctor, Colin Peter or whatever. Peter Facinelli. Peter, yeah, and he was from. Uh, from can't and, hardly wait. Can't and I re- wait. and I respected can't the man. I, I respect Bill Bellamy. Yeah, that too. It, exactly. And I respected him from back in those movies. And he's uh-huh. like, and he's like, well, what this movie's about? He goes, we integrated with the people of the. He didn't t- say anything about like it was the backstory of the books, or I didn't get nothing from the books. No. He said nothing about the books. So, me and my male friend Kent, who's older than you. We, we and we're like looking at like let's just go see a movie or something together. And we're going through whatever movies around. Like I go, this is a vampire movie. You, you remember Lost Boys? Like we'll go watch a Lost Boys type movie. And he's you like, remember Lost Boys? And and we thought it well. Well, we're Lost Boys fans. Like we'll go watch. Let's see if this modern vampire movie can stand up to Lost Boys. <laughs> Walk in to the theater. We are the only men there. Only men. <laughs> what was the average age of the women in there? Yeah. The women oh were. It God. was opening night. Opening night. The opening night. <laughs> oh, so shit. there, there wasn't, there wasn't a le- <laughs> there was not a legal girl in the crowd. <laughs> they were all fifteen ish. And and I'm like, dude, what is going on? And he's like, I, I don't know. Did you? Have so to we be sit a- down. <laughs> we sit down next to these girls, and they're fucking staring at us like. <laughs> <laughs> and like, like just giving us the weirdest look in the world like they were scared and i'm like what we're here to watch the movie and all and, I'm here to come. and then fucking i knew i knew exactly what was there was minutes of the movies went by but i knew what the problem was when uh robert pattinson's character edward edward, edward walks by and Cohen. the entire crowd goes <laughs> like, in, in, if the girls hadn't gone through puberty yet, they did then. In in, in oh unison, God. and I'm looking. I'm like, I'm like, dude, it's a fucking teen girl movie. It's like, what? I go, we're in a teen girl movie. It's like, nah. I'm like, yeah, we are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, look, I'm like, look around. They think we're gay. <laughs> <laughs> did you watch the whole movie? I, I well, I'm there. I paid my money. <laughs> well, so you sat through when the vampires glowed in the sunlight. <laughs> the baseball scene. Well, well oh, no. Well, God. here here's the scene. <laughs> and I and Kent can and can verify this as a hundred percent fact. I knew nothing about the thing. And when the scene is like, I'm gonna reveal my real self to you. That scene. When he's like, yeah. And he and he goes up there and he starts sparkling. I'm like, I'm like, this fucking shit was written by a woman. Yeah. I said it right there. I'm like, this is written by a woman. And he's like, I think you're right. I'm like, and then of course it was. It was. Oh, yeah. And I, I was like, because I was expecting him to like go in the sunlight and he's going to have horns. Like, eh, bleh. And he's like, Sparkle. I'm like, dude, we're in the wrong Sparkles. motherfucking place. Well, did you watch the rest of them? Well, yeah. Sure. <laughs> no, no. Did, did you watch all four, all four, five? No. Movies? One, two, three, I four, watched, four, five, five. I did watch. Well, the one thing I did take away from that film that I, that I'm like took away, the original red-haired girl. I don't know, gorgeous. The not the yeah, one that for took Victoria. Over, Vic, yeah, Victoria's character. I think I don't know. The, the, yeah, the girl, Victoria. The, the yeah. Victoria's character, the original girl, um, Ron Howard's daughter, took over. Yes, but she's oh cute. But the original, the, the original girl, I was like, that is a. Most beautiful fucking woman I ever seen in my life. And More then she was gone. Than... And she was gone after <laughs> Elizabeth one... Shue. The uh, she was no no Elizabeth Shue, but she's close. <laughs> but I was like, I.